in the modern world, in the world you live in today, in the West, you don't raise your children and you don't own your children. You've had these children, I like to believe, because you're in love with your partner and you want to replicate yourself and purport your worldviews. And the way you view the world, you want that to be instilled in this child. That's not the case. They wanted the woman at work because if the woman's at home, she likely agrees with the worldviews of her man. And that means the children are being raised by the mother and they're likely to adopt those worldviews. In the modern world where they convince a woman to get a job, the man to get a job, they inflate the currency so nobody can exist any other way because it's too expensive. The parents are out working all day. The school and the internet and the matrix raise your children. Your children go to school all day and be told things that you may not want them to learn. Yeah. Then they sit on the internet and read things and watch things you may not want them to watch. Yeah. You talk to them for 10 minutes at the end of the day and they go to bed. You're fighting with your 10 minutes against endless hours of the most entertaining programming or the most forceful programming. In school, it's forceful. On the internet, it's entertaining. Convincing them of ideas that you perhaps don't agree with. Have you ever tried to take your children out of school? You'll get fined. You'll get in trouble. No, your kids have to go to school. Yeah. You have to give your kids away to the school. If you don't give your kids away to the brainwashing, mm. you'll get in trouble. Yeah. And the reason they're doing this is because they want to control the youth because the youth is, of course, the future of the world. Cool. And you have to understand that this whole idea of feminism, this is what I'm saying. I'm sure. saying that we shouldn't allow children to be brainwashed. We shouldn't separate Absolutely. them from their parents to the point where Absolutely. they're going to absorb ideals. Like, and I've seen the Muslim community, the only ones standing at the gates of schools saying, yeah. you're not going to teach this to our kids. Absolutely. The only ones who will stand up against it.